23 ABC's digital update is brought to you by West Medical. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Bayon Wang and here is your digital update. Passengers on the Carnival Panorama cruise ship in Long Beach were released after a medical situation forced them to stay on board for an additional day. The delay was the result of a passenger getting sick on the cruise who was subsequently tested for the coronavirus. The results from that test were returned as negative. The ship pulled into the port at 8 a.m. Saturday with no one allowed to leave. This allowed to affect it. This also affected a new set of passengers who were expected to set sail. BPD officials are investigating a DUI crash in central Bakersfield that left two people with moderate injuries. Just after midnight, officers responded to the 2300 block of Myrtle Street for an injury collision. According to BPD, officers found a truck on fire at the scene. The driver had gotten out of the truck, but two passengers were stuck inside. Officers were able to get the passengers out. The two passengers are currently in stable condition. The driver, 21-year-old Kevin Aranda, was determined to be intoxicated and was arrested for felony DUI causing injury. He was booked into Kern County Jail. Bakersfield police officials have arrested two people suspected of an armed robbery in South Bakersfield Saturday night. According to police, at least one of the suspects held the victim at gunpoint and robbed him near the Valley Plaza Mall at about 10 p.m. before fleeing. Officers found the suspects and their vehicle by the target near the mall. When they searched the car, officers found a gun and the stolen items, according to BPD. The two suspects were arrested after the search. If you have any information about this case, contact BPD at 327-7111. And for the rest of the day, we're going to see those clear conditions near those seasonal temperatures. It's, it's pretty warm compared to what we saw just yesterday with that slight cool down. But another storm is expected to make landfall this Tuesday afternoon into Wednesday morning. That will bring heavy rain and snow into our mountain and desert areas. The rain amounts are about one to one and a half inches possible and that we're going to be monitoring that at Lebec through the grapevine when that storm does make its landfall Tuesday afternoon. Take a look at the radar. You see that low pressure system when that moves through that's going to bring colder air and that rain to come with it as well. There's going to be cloud cover, so a dramatic, a drastic change from what we saw just the past few days. But here's our forecasted lows for tonight. We're in the mid 40s, 45 in Bakersfield, 46 in Arvin and 44 at the Grapevine, 39 in California City, 41 in Jawbone Canyon. For tomorrow, we will see highs in the high 60s, 69 for Bakersfield, 55 for Lebec, 47 in Fraser Park and 53 in Lake Isabella. But again, when that storm makes its way through on Tuesday, you see that 80% chance of rain. So it's going to be heavy rain expected for the desert and mountain communities. We will also have a low of 49 and two Wednesday. Uh, the remaining parts of that storm system will bring a 60% chance of rain. We'll have a high of 70 and a low of 50 rain chances. Also in our mountain communities are pretty high. Uh, Kern River Valley to Hatchby and even Fraser Park. You have above 80% 80% chance of rain on Tuesday and we will be tracking uh, what that means for your work week. And for your top news and weather headlines, head to our website, turnit23.com. Take care.